You want a mall story? I'll give you a mall story. My story. I've been working at this mall for nine years. And these people continuously get me to do things that I don't really want to do. One morning, the grinder broke down in the meat room. And instead of getting a, an, another an employee, they got me to go with the boxes of meat and go and grind it at a different store. So I loaded up all the boxes in my car and drove off. I got on the highway and all of a sudden, boxes of meat flew at the back of my car. So I stopped, did a U-turn, I came back, looking for all these boxes of meat, and I only found one of them. One was missing, of course. I get to the other store, grind some meat up, and I know I, I'm missing meat. So what did I do? Is put some other substitute meat in. They, no one ever knew. If that isn't bad enough, another day, they continuously harass me all day long, making fun of me, joking around. You know, but a joke's a joke, so it should have been over. I'm so upset, I leave the store, one of the automatic doors don't open for me. I get in the other automatic door, it doesn't open, so I kick the damn thing. Glass goes everywhere. Who got blamed for that? Me. You know, and if that isn't bad enough, I nicely get back, starting to calm down, and they start bothering me again. Call me names, poking fun at me, continuously, continuously, continuously. And then you know what I do? Because I'm late for, for work, I run to get to the time clock. And I trip over a damn banana box. You know what the result of that is? This! This is the result of that! Look at this, I'm scarred for life because of that store. Three seconds in, 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 into the store, and I do this. Stay the hell away from these damn places. This is the result of what can happen. This is the damn result of what can happen.